her. Why are you sitting there smiling like that? You're like. <laughs> <laughs> Don't do that. You like got a blank stare on your face like. Don't do that. What? <laughs> you cannot be in my video like that. What was that? Was you praying? Oh, he's bringing good vibes and yeah. feng shui to yourself. Okay, well, can you get me some? <laughs> to you too. Stupid. <laughs> okay, you ready? There's nothing like chilling with my girls. Just me and my divas. Taking over the world. Hey, divas. Hey, divas. Let me tell you now, D. What's up, divas and divos? It's your two girls, April and Nay. And Nay. Well, I was about to call you Mumsy. That would have been Joshua. But anyway, so this video is, of course, a fashion haul from Yes, Rose Gal. You see, this is why I don't have them on that much anymore because they're bad co-hosts. Like seriously, I've got two that's bad. Mostly she's shady, and then she just forget what was we don't even talk about. But anyway, so you ready for this is Rose Gal. So this is a video for Rose Gal and of course me and Nate do those together. There's Rose Gal, there's Zafu, there's Sammy Dress, there's Lily, no, Dress Lily, yep. Yeah. And a Rose Wholesale and like a bunch others that are all sister affiliate websites. So you guys, you definitely want to check them out. You can always find coupon codes like Retail Me Not or also if you sign up to their websites, they will send you an email almost like twice a week or whatever, giving you codes and discounts and sales and new arrivals. So it probably is more than twice a week. So this is the number one key to this and I say this in all my videos. So if you're new to my channel, welcome. Thank you for subscribing. Make sure you hit that notifications bell. But this is the number one key to Rose Gal, to Sammy Dress, to Zappo, to any of their affiliate sites. They do have processing time. It says three to five days, seven to 10 days, or 10 to 15 days, or 15 days, or something like that. So, or in stock. I normally pick everything that is either in stock or available, or three days processing. Sometimes we do like five to 10 days, but I never really go past five to 10 days because you know, your items will come and they will ship separately, okay? Usually the five to 10 days like get here soon too. It does, right? The five to 10 days. So the five to 10 days does get here soon. This time around, um, you know, our stuff did come, one shipment did come really early and then the other one took a little bit longer. Um, I think it was this one here that took a little bit longer, it did. Um, and also keep in mind that for every item that you're looking for, well not every item, but if you want to buy or purchase clothing from them, I would definitely suggest measuring yourself and then looking at the size charts for each garment because each one will vary. So you definitely want to check that out. Don't just go up a size or two like other people say because your items may still not fit, you know what I'm saying? So my issue was this, um, well not this go round, but um, I've lost a lot of weight so I'm still like shopping for some reason for like my old weight. And I really don't know, like, you know, certain things. Like, I'm kind of in between their sizes because they do have a wide selection of plus size clothing, which fits me good, but some of them may be a little bit too big. And then, like, the regular size clothing, it all depends on what it is. I cannot wear everything. So just keep that in mind to make sure that you look at the size charts. So I um, we didn't really get that much stuff this time um, because we didn't really see much stuff. Um, I think it was because it was like the end of the season and so we really didn't know what to choose and so you know we just decided to get just little things that we liked and then you know a couple of things that we needed. So I will let Nate go first. Since there wasn't um, enough like stuff to go through, usually if there is, I'll, the first thing I'll usually go to look at is their socks because usually my socks are either getting lost or stolen or usually I just go around and pick my socks so I like to have... I got two pairs of socks, two pairs, two, two pairs of 
two packs. Two packs. Yeah, one of them are, one of these are for months. Also, you know what? She's gonna think that your socks are her socks, and then she's gonna steal your socks. Yeah, they have little prints on them. Socks. Well, how many pairs come with it, girl? Um, comes with five pairs. Five pairs, and they're just anklet socks. Yeah. She's not doing a really good description of the damn socks. They're just anklet socks. Smack me in the face with it. Oh God, they're just anklet socks. This one has a paintbrush and some paint on it. Okay. This one has I don't know what. It looks like shopping some luggage. Bags. Oh, shopping bag. I don't know what this is right here, and I'm pretty sure you can't make it out neither. This one has some crowns on it. And it looks like paint. And this one looks like, what? I don't know what this does, but it looks like it has something to do with arts and crafts. But they're just little anklet socks. Um, I don't know if they would fit a bigger foot size. Like, I wear a size 11. These things would probably never fit me, but they're cute. You get five pairs. I think they were like, what, $2.99? Usually the socks are cheap, either from like 2 to $4. And what else you got there, my dear? You got another pack of socks. These are cute, I love these. And these are just like, I would wear with like regular sneakers, like. Not never around the house. I'm like wearing my socks around the house. I'll just wear them for like school and everything. Like that. Those are cute. I like white socks. But black socks never go with anything. Never. I hate black socks. Don't you have a pair of black socks? No. Black socks are cute. I don't buy black socks. You have enough socks. Yeah, I know, but I never buy black ones because if you see me in a pair of black ones, they weren't mine. Probably stole them from the basket. I got me some backdrops, okay? So I'm not going to like, well, you know, I really don't want to open them because then it's like, heck, it's hard for me to put them back. Put Plus, up. Yeah, I will. I'll definitely put the picture up. So I got um, three backdrops um, because, you know, I like to change my background. But I haven't used my backdrop in like quite a few videos because I've just been lazy. So I just wanted to be organic. Organic is not just a type of thing for food. You mean nothing like natural, just organic, just or regular. Oldies. Throwback. Throwback, whatever you want to call it. So whenever I decide to use the backdrop again, I will put these up. So I did get this one, which is really pretty. I've been wanting this one for a minute, and it's just like a leafy color. It's cute, it's plain, you know, jazzes it up. And then I wanted this one for the longest and did not know that Rose Gal had it. It has like some really great, amazing backdrops on Rose Gal. And this one I wanted for a long time. I did see this on like Amazon. They went like 30 something dollars, hunties. And then I seen it on eBay. So it's super cheap. They're really affordable. Anywhere from $10 and below or up, you know what I'm saying, depending on the size. And then this one, the last backdrop that I got is just like this floral print. And it has just like the backdrop. I love stuff like this because it just looks so nice. So what you got, girl? Um, um I got this mermaid blanket they came in all different um colors the one downside of it is that the thing is open at the bottom oh they're not supposed to be i don't know i just don't like my feet being cold i hate when my feet are cold especially in the blanket because that's when the blankets are torn well how does it feel does it keep you <laughs> does it keep you warm yeah it's, it's really comforting i knew oh comforting not comfy it's very comforting huh like it's very nice it's made out of nice material like um like yarn material I tried to put it on me the other day. Girl, I was like, please, somebody give me a regular blanket. I am not about to climb oh, yeah, into blanket. Like, it. it was on my couch. And I was in pain, remember? Uh, so, and I could not get up to put that on. I wasn't about to slither in a blanket. Oh, yeah, you have to like stand up, put your feet in and stand up. You have to jump a few times to get your feet. To get your face you to the bottom of the thing. It depends. Because if you're like, if you're short like me, you probably won't have to. Because it's just like. I'd rather just freeze. Oh. This last thing was um this eyeliner thing with cat liners on it. Um, just for makeup and stuff. Um, just to, to practice my wings. Because I want to improve my makeup skills. Mm. Yeah, it only comes with two um stencils. Um, see, so like, um, but there's more than. Yeah, there's more than one side to it. Um, see it? No, that's not gonna do. The paper is bigger than your hand. <laughs> like, what the hell? So basically, what she's saying is this. Okay, look. You see the cat? Meow, meow. 
And on the cat is like a bunch of little lines. There's some right here, curved line, and right here is a curved line, and then so forth. And all you do is basically put it up to your eye. I don't know how. You guys have a really small eye for this. Well, what the heck? Well, what's all these numbers for? This is where you're supposed to put the wing. No, at. look, it's just see if, if it's one, if it's one on the cat. And oh, one goes there. okay. So, okay. All right. So you just got to do it like a certain way. It's a cute concept. Okay. So it has these numbers on it, like right here. And you just follow the back of the thing. Follow the thing because girls, I would, be, I would have you all messed up with this thing right here. It's cat line. We're going to see how this works out. So then the last two things are me trying on some outfits, uh, two outfits that I got from Rose Gal. So uh, the first one is this one piece floral romper. It's really cute. It's more or less like a surplus type of crossing on the front. You do buckle it or close it in the back and they it does have pockets. The length of the pants are really nice. It's kind of like wide legged, so I do like that. And you know, it's still really hot here. It's not really hot, but you know, with this particular romper, you can still dress it up with like a blazer or a jacket like I did show in the beginning. So that way if it's colder where you're at, you can definitely still wear it and just dress it up with like a nice jacket or cardigan. It, it fit nice. It's a size large. The only downfall, I did get this in the plus size section for one. The only downfall is I don't really care for where they actually put the waist at. Okay. I would have liked the waist to be a little bit further down because it makes me feel like I'm bigger, but I still think it's a really cute outfit. Um, it's floral. It did fit nice. The only also other issue is I had to kind of like pin it in the back by where it closed at because if I didn't, it would have just kept opening in the front. So yeah, I did like this. And then the last thing was this like body con gray kind of like sports kind of style v-neck dress i like this this is cute i really do this is also for the plus size section and it's in a size large it's not too short and it's not too dressy because i don't really like to be too dressy i don't really like to wear shoes or dress shoes okay i like to wear shoes on my feet but i don't really like to be wearing no heels um i felt like i was bloated i am kind of bloated um doing this try on right here and i just gotta go back to working out again like i stopped for like a month because I've just been going through some complications. But other than that, I think this is really cute. It fit nice. And so that is all for our Rose Gal haul. That, that is all for our Rose Gal haul. <laughs> so we're going to do another haul. You see it's the same stuff. So you guys, we love you. Make sure you rate, comment, subscribe. Thumbs this video up. That's something to say. Bye, yo. That was real good. <laughs> so, on that note, we'll see you guys on the other side. So she said, bye, yo. That was so ghetto. That was so ghetto. <laughs>